everybody, and what's going back today? Ever a gimmicky another sun episode with more Dragon Ball Z Kakura Chunt Rewards of Hope on the Nintendo Switch. So welcome to it. So, we have another rundown with the Androids, and um, somehow we just uh, got away so quick because these Androids are just getting really, really tough. And we weren't expecting for Chunt to show out of nowhere just so that he could just uh, fight the Android on his own, just so that the Android can just go and finish off Chunt. But, um, no, nah, I mean, they wanted to keep Trunks alive, well, so be it. I mean, they they think they're getting not uh, super strong, and we're going to have to go back to the past again, and just to, uh, to check in with uh, Goku, just to see if uh, everything is right. Well, so be it, let's go ahead and speak to Boma, and we go talk to her. Oh, it'd be nice if the time machine finished charging sometime soon. Okay, so, um, let's see, so, so, so we, should we say I still need some time, or I'm ready to go, and then show the story? Um, okay, well, you know what? Uh, we don't actually have much time to do right now, but hold on, let's, uh, like let's get more time here. So, as you guys can see here, so before we go on ahead and accept the, um, the next story, I want to go ahead and show you throughout the city that it's uh, all tear apart with uh, no people around it anymore. So, if we go ahead and look at this uh, mini map, well, actually, hold on. So, there are still a couple more of these uh, drones that we have to go take out. So, uh, I will see you once all of these uh, drones are. Annihilated. So, uh, see you back. Alright, guys, I think that's it. So, I just uh, cleared all of these drones. And now, as you can see in this uh, map, because uh, we want to go ahead and start off back at the researcher to, to get as many rewards as possible for a chain for drone parts. So, we should head somewhere down at the east coast. And I already have that pinpoint already where we saw it on the, the far on the right. Because that's where the um, the light shows to the main story where we go talk to Boma. I mean, we need like a few extra time just to make uh, more preparation. Just to stock up more mega potions. Get plenty of the um, the scrolls and etc. I mean, you, you get the idea because we, we had to like gain all the points that we could experience just so that we can uh, get many rewards. Or any other material that we need for uh, along in our journey. Well, in case we want to go ahead and like... B purchase new recipe. I mean, be my guest. I mean, that's something you get from the uh, third DLC, or maybe uh, when you um, return back to the main story. I mean, you can go back to Chi's house and she'll go and cook you right out whatever it comes available. Oh, have you found the pot? Yeah, we do. So, um, let's uh, see what we want to go and get. So, we only got more than five. So, you know, let's get this out live for the Z or Magnet scroll. So uh, we need to get one for that. So we got only last but five for each. Okay, so we want to go and get one of that. And something about these items, we're going to have to come back to that later. So let's go ahead and press B. And let's uh, be setting out. Now we can go ahead and take a look at for, for the attack, for super attack skill tree for before moving on. Let's just see if we uh, have that unlocked. Oh, you know what? Oh, wait a minute. So we have it down here. Okay. So we have something for for cell medication for some sort. But uh, we're gonna have to keep on saving up more Z orbs, all right? Well, actually, let's just get one last for this uh the Z or Madnik on level two. So it says apply 30% to Z orb attain when you win a battle. Okay. So we wanted to to get more and more Z orb. Because that is how we experience. So we want to keep that in mind because we'll get a lot of Z or right out of it. When we uh, win the, the, the battle against uh, the androids or or the cell. Well, the cell is in the name of the other boss. I mean, the cell go and, and absorb android. Remember that? I mean, that was since uh, chapter 3 or episode 3, I mean. So let's go ahead and uh, talk to Bulma. I think we're all done. Machine finished charging sometime soon. Well, the uh, the time machine look look like it's uh it's good to go. So uh, it doesn't need any charging or repair or anything like that. Let's just uh, continue on to the next story. Are you good to go? The machine still needs a bit of time to charge. So. Uh, wait a minute. Hold on. The machine still needs a bit of time to charge. So just hold tight, okay? Okay, that's more like it. Several months later. The machines finally got enough energy for another round trip. 
Now you can go back and help the others. I hope they're all safe. I'm sure they are. Maybe they've already defeated the androids and brought peace back to the world. If that's the case, it might be nice to bring the others back here with me. The time machine only has room for one person. But I can totally see the others cramming their way in anyway. Goku would jump at the chance to take on more powerful opponents. <laughs> You're right. Based on what I saw of him, he would probably be excited to come here. But if they haven't defeated the androids, you're planning on joining in on the fight, aren't you? Just be careful, okay? Don't get yourself killed. I won't. And you stay safe too, Mom. I'll make it back in one piece. I can't rest until our world is at peace too. And so, Trunks made his way back to the past. Little did he realize that waiting for him there were two completely different androids, as well as less ruthless, but still dangerous androids 17 and 18. And to make matters worse, Cell, a bio-android far deadlier than the other androids, had appeared and threatened all life on Earth. But thanks to Goku and the others' training, as well as Gohan's transformation into something beyond that of a Super Saiyan, Cell was defeated. With peace now restored in the past, Trunks returns to the future, more experienced and determined to save his world. Mom, I'm back. Welcome home, Trunks. Wait just a minute. Look at you. They say kids grow up fast, but this is ridiculous. I trained in a special place called the Hyperbolic Time Chamber. It's on Kami's lookout. One year inside is only a day on the outside. Not really sure how that works, but at any rate, I'm just glad you're back and doing okay. So, did everything work out? That look on your face tells me it did. It did. Oh, so Goku still ended up dying in the end. Well, at least Gohan was able to avenge him. Yeah. Oh, and you were right about Father. He wasn't just a cold-hearted person after all. Huh? When I first saw him fight, I honestly thought he was just a ruthless, selfish person. You know what I mean? If you and baby me were ever in danger, he didn't try to save us. All he cared about was his opponent. Oh, Vegeta. Can't say I'm all that surprised, though. <laughs> but during the year me and him trained together, he was more focused on the moment. He was tough on himself and even seemed a little lonely. Right. Now that I think about it, he could be like that at times. He wouldn't spar with me at first, but eventually, he grew to acknowledge my power. We would have serious sparring matches, and sometimes even conversations. Conversations? About what? Um, well, I say conversations, but it was really just me talking to him, not with him. He would only reply with, I see, or, Mph. the conversations never really went anywhere. Jeez, <laughs> that's Vegeta for you. But, right as our training was coming to an end. All right, so this new story recap saying, having, have, having traveled to the past and witnessed a peace restored there, Charles has made his way back to the future. He recalls his time training with the Vegeta and informed Bulma of what happened. 
Trunks tells Bulma of his time in the past, specifically when Cell, eager to increase his power, began draining the population of their energy. Nearly a year inside the hyperbolic time chamber had passed since Vegeta and Trunks first entered and began their training to defeat Cell. Come at me at full power. Okay, father. Here I go. I shouldn't have to say this, but do not hold back. I won't. Okay, so we have traveled to the past again and to the future. So it seems like that we are finding the other uh, young version of Vegeta at the Super Saiyan. What well, what does like is it that the Vegeta is Super Saiyan, the, his second transformation of Super Saiyan 2? I mean, um, I could have sworn that is what the, the right transformation that Vegeta performed. Okay, well, we won't be bothering to listen to these guys talk, but we can still keep on putting up more uh, full attack. So, as you can see, because I did equip here the burning attack, which I'm going to still use. Okay, so we're gonna go for Masenko. Hopefully, he doesn't avoid that. Okay, well, I see that uh, Vegeta is gonna start by launching the Gala Gun at me. Uh, no, not today. So I'm gonna shoot the um, the Masenko back at you because I know you're gonna go for Gala Gun. I just knew it. Okay, hold on. So we need to chi up. Okay, well he's not gonna still keep fighting. Okay, so we did go for the Shining Sword attack there. Okay, so let's see what else we got. So I want to go with, uh... Okay, well, we got away from that garlic gun there. Okay, and that to finish. That should be enough for now. But I'm still a far cry where I should be. You even more so. Father. Okay, so we got all the orb, and we level up. So there you see because we got Trunks at level 40, so we got him up to speed. You know, it's almost been a year since we started our training. We should probably get ready to give the room to Goku and Gohan. No, not until I achieve the absolute power I deserve. I intend to use every second we've got in here. But you've already broken the Super Saiyan barrier. Are you trying to push yourself even further? <laughs> if I plan on destroying Cell and finally putting Kakarot in his place, then I need to be stronger. I'm not going to get through to him at this point. He won't stop training until he's the one who's satisfied. Father, is surpassing Goku more important to you than defeating Cell? <laughs> You've got it a bit wrong. What I want is simply to be number one. Kakarot just happens to be an obstacle between me and my rightful place at the top. And what's worse is that he's a Saiyan like me. Trunks, as a proud Saiyan yourself, you should never set limits on the power you can attain. You should always strive to be the best. But know this, as long as I'm around, you're going to have fierce competition. Father, this might actually be the first time he's given me fatherly advice. If you can call it that. This obsession with power. Goku loves to fight powerful enemies too. Maybe it's a pure-blooded Saiyan thing. In my world, all I could think about was defeating the androids. Restoring peace was more important to me than the pursuit of strength. You said that Gohan was the only one who trained you, right? <laughs> he's just as soft and naive as Kakarot. No, he's not. What's even more concerning, though, is that I was killed by the androids in your time so easily. Me, the Prince of the Saiyans. Huh? Don't be satisfied with simply beating the androids and restoring peace. Those are short-sighted goals at best. I'm going to push myself harder. And I won't stop until I am number one. If you do the same, 
and you aim for something better. I'm sure you'll have no problem with the androids. Father! You're right. I'll do what I can. John spent a back on his training with Vegeta and how they talk about uh, what it means to become stronger and the importance of Saiyan pride. Um, how interesting. Okay. Well, we're getting a lot from it with the um, with relationship between Vegeta and Trunks. What we saw in the cutscene, uh, what they're um, voice asking about. I mean, that is how they are uh, related to become number one strong Saiyans. So, we might as well see to you on the next cutscene. I see. So that's what he told you. Why does he have to encourage him in such a roundabout way? I actually tried talking to him about other things, too. But when I asked him when he started to develop feelings for you, he got really angry and told me to stop asking dumb questions. <laughs> also, in the fight with Cell, he got really angry when Cell killed me. Wh what did I tell you? I told you he wasn't that bad. Yeah. Wow, was that really my Vegeta? I never knew he had that side to him. Um, okay, so here's a store reward which we did experience, and we got one mega heal aid. Okay, we'll need it. Two fancy range and one D metal. Okay, that's alright. We'll take it. We'll take a level up, of course. Oh, what a relief. I'm glad to hear things ended well over there. I'm relieved too. Looks like going to the past was a good call. The past may be at peace now, but our world here is still in turmoil because of androids 17 and 18. I can't let them get away with this anymore. We interrupt this program to bring you news on the android crisis. Androids 17 and 18 are currently laying waste to... The androids. This ends today. I'll be back, Mom. Trunks, are you sure you can do this? I'll be fine. This is the whole reason I went back in time and met Goku, Gohan, my father, and the others. The past has its peace now. We deserve our own. Be careful, Trunks. Please don't get yourself killed. Of course. And this is it. I can finally avenge Gohan and the others. Okay, so we got a pod menu because Trunk is still the um the same old self he used to be as grown up. But uh, to me, cause as you can, if we press on B real quick. So as you can see, but god damn, this this is badass, you guys. I mean, Trunk look exactly like he's a uh, full train at the Super Saiyan back in the uh, hyperbolic time chamber. I mean, Trunk is uh, putting up a whole lot of his training. I mean, he did a pretty good job with that. So. We can start on by checking with our party and going back to Super Attack Skill Tree. Now, there's something else that we must go and view. So, it seems like uh, we can build up more combos to the level plus one to to increase up to level two. So, this effect remains active once acquired. Increase the hit co accounts for melee combo. We need to get that. We have to. It's the only way we're going to get build more stronger. So, we have to go and build as uh, much task that we can build up. So, it seems like... But now, I mean, we had to complete our training a little bit. Because it seemed like that we had to get as many orbs as possible. So, I mean, that's something we could take on. So, now, let's uh, do see what we got here. So, so we got here the Neo Dive Bomb Slash Kick. I mean, we, we want just, just to just save up a leech for a little bit of experience. So, you know what? Let's just uh, hold on with... With the upgrading for now, and uh, let's hold up, hold up with the uh, training ground. I mean, it's been a long fight, but it's finally about to end. I mean, we did level up fast. We can restore our home to what it used to be. If only you could be here to see this, Gohan. Okay, so we have to head into uh, the Orange City. So I did saw what's on the um, on the objective. So we can go back to the world map, and we can uh, warp our way back to the Orange City. I mean, Orange City doesn't look quite. Quite good, but uh, less awful.
But uh, we'll, we'll check that there just to see what we need to be doing. So just as Trump finished telling Boma about his uh, endeavor in the path, uh, he hears a report about an Android attack. He blasts out ready to destroy the Android and finally bring peace to his world. Okay. Now, it's um it's up to Trump now, so we have to go ahead and restore peace to the, uh, to the whole world. All right, so we're going to have to put a stop to all of this uh, in, in our time in the future. So let's go on and check that there. Okay, so there's plenty more people in this own city. So let's go ahead and and take our landing approach there. Look at you. You're throwing a little temper tantrum because you lost the game. Shut the hell up! I don't want to hear a peep from you! Seventeen! Eighteen! This is it! This is the day you finally pay for what you've done! Trunks. So you're alive, huh? Makes sense, I guess. You always were a little too dumb to give up. Seventeen, I'm in a really bad mood. I know you want to mess with him, but I'm just gonna kill him right now. Cause he's annoying as hell. It won't be as fun without him around. But sure, okay. Go for it, Eighteen. This has gone on far too long. Ever since you two first appeared, every day has been like hell as we struggled to survive. Hmm. So what's your point? The versions of you I met when I traveled to the past were actually kind of nice. But here, you've done nothing but destroy towns and cities and murder countless people. You're gonna pay for it! Oh my god, would you shut up? Let's do this! Alright, so now everything's in quiet, we're gonna go ahead and fight Android 18. So now we are playing as solo, finally. And so we're not playing, so we're not fighting double, not Android 17, okay. Okay, so we'll keep going with that. Alright, and we'll go ahead and suck up to the, the paint and still keep on dealing more melee. So. It seems like that we can uh, deal amount of a hit on Android 18. So that's uh, what we plan on doing, just to build up more combos. All right, so let's keep going. Well, we don't feel that um, that strongly enough to beat up Android 18, but we are now because we have enough less um a lot power to beat up Android 18. So hold on, hold on, watch out. So I'm gonna keep going with more die bomb slash kit there. Okay, what the heck was that? Okay, so do you have to spam that? Okay, but now she did vanish. I see. Okay, I was quite aware of that. I don't know what it go to ways. I didn't see why I had to use the D stick to to heal up. So we're just gonna keep blocking. Oh, what? Okay? That's way too powerful. So, yeah, so you just stay tired. And you get Masenko. So, let's see. Now, I only got one of this energy supplement B left, so I'm just gonna have to save up a little. Well, you look like a child player to me. I mean, you're just destroying. All, you're just destroying towns and people. That's what you do for fun. I mean, you just uh, become so evil. Okay, so so the best goal is to finish off this Android 18, and then while Android 18 give up, then we'll go fight Android 17, and maybe when Cell appears, then maybe that will be our final battle to be up Cell. I mean, who knows? We we may as well find out. Okay, well, hold on. So, we are training Trunt a little bit. Because we, we want to keep that up. I mean, that is how we, we build up more combo. Because we wanted to keep Trunt a lot stronger. 
So how many mega potions do we have? I mean I only got two for each. Okay, what in the heck? I can't block. What the heck is going on? Okay, something just happened. Wow, 18. You're getting kind of sloppy. Ugh. Damn it. I've had enough of this little punk. I'll take both of you on at the same time! What's going on? Something's different about him. Let's do this! You two are finally going to beat your end! You hear me? You're crazy if you think that's gonna happen. Let's kill him, okay, so we're going for round two. So now Andrew 17 is going to have backup now. So this not gonna be pretty easy because Andrew 17 is gonna get way too distracted and we need to be careful about this. So I'm gonna go ahead and cheat up a little bit. So nope, you stay far back. And I can't use super attacks because these guys can't these guys have no skip still. Oh, hold on. So we'll go use super attack. Because I go for one of the birdie attack ability because that's on level 2, I, I guess. Okay, I think we got in the right time. So let's keep follow up more attacks. Okay, so we only follow up at least two combos. Because that's how we roll. I mean, we have that in the upgrade already in uh, Super Attack Skill Tree. Okay, so we're gonna watch out whatever Aaron Jones 17 is about to do. is not gonna be pretty. Um, okay. Nice animation going on there. Can't lie about that. Alright, well, they're all getting pretty powerful there. Okay, we need to escape. Okay, bro, they're getting way too distracted, and I can't move a muscle. Come on, Tron, you got this. Just remember your training in the past. Okay, so now that they're getting tired, so we can finally go and take the, the both of them out. Okay, so Android 18 got three lives left, so why do you have to keep parrying? Stop parrying, just let me hit you. Okay, hold on a minute, hold on. Okay, so I wanted to avoid whatever Andrew 17 is about to do. I'm not going to fall for it. Because he's going to go for that plasma blast. Uh, so, and it will go and suck me up. So I don't want to go any near that. So the best goal is to avoid his uh, his shots whenever he go and strike at you. You, you want to, to make sure you're taking much cover in a safe distance. Just to be clear. So, so we're just uh, tackling on Andrew 18. Why are you moving all over the place? Yeah, I know Trunks' uh, attacks were getting a, a bit sloppy because uh, she's moving all over the place. Okay, now it's going back to that again. So we want to make sure we parry that. Okay, let's move. Come on. Okay, so he's not going to get stunned. Come on now. Okay, well, they're pretty, they're pretty skillful. Okay, so those are the projectile we were supposed to avoid. Okay, so now I just lock on with the shining sword attack at the right timing to finish off Android 18. All right, we'll be back, we'll be back with Android 17 later, right after Android 18 take the finish and blow. Okay, so now we got it. So now it's our chance we go finish off with the Masenko and then go finish off Android, Android 17. Okay, so you know what? Let's go and heal up a little bit. So we need all the healing we can gain. And I'm going to save up only two of those uh, mega healing. Uh, I don't like to the, the, the waste as uh, many he mega healing I need. So we're just going to have to save but only one. 
Uh, no, I'm not falling for that. Whatever you're about to do, I cannot fall for it. Okay, right on time. Hold on, let's uh, go for sh Shining Die Bomb Slash. Oh, uh, Die Bomb Slash Kid. Sorry, got that, that name messed up there. Forgive me, it was uh, kind of sloppy why I say that word. Okay, so Angel 17 is about to lose, so he's not going to win. Okay, so we're going to keep going with it. So we go with the flow. And we finally got ourselves a break. Alright, so that's how we go and stun an android. Okay, so we, we just trigger here is another animation going on there. That's very nice. Okay, so we can do all of that combo there. So let's keep getting more. Okay, so I can't go easy on you, so you need to be taught a lesson. Okay, I think this is it. It's over. That was for the friends of mine you killed. And this? This is for Gohan! <laughs> Well game, you got that right. That was definitely finished. Okay, so we're getting everything. Nice. Phew. It's over. I finally did it, everyone. Wait, not yet. There's still one thing left. Okay, fi so it says Trunks finally de defeats Android 17 and 18, eventually Gohan and all those who fell in the Twin Terror. Uh, however, Trunks know that uh, one final threat does still stand between him and True Peace. Okay then, well, we might as well watch this cutscene and find out. So let's all have a watch. As we wait until this game takes its time to load. Alright game, anytime you're ready. Just over three years later, with 17 and 18 gone, people have begun to rebuild cities and towns that were ravaged by the androids. Trunks was eager to inform those in the past of his success, so with the time machine fully charged, he prepared for another trip. All right, Mom, I'm off. Have a safe trip, Trunks. Tell everyone I said hi. Sure. You need to leave, Mom. Head somewhere safe. Huh? Uh, oh, okay. I know you're over there, Cell. What? You plan on killing me, then traveling to the past to absorb androids 17 and 18 and obtain your perfect form. How... How could you possibly know that? Your plan's going to fail, because I'm going to finish you off once and for all. My plan's going to fail, is it? <laughs> well, you're awfully cocky. So? Your perfect form was insanely strong, there's no doubt about that. But as you are now, I'm more than enough to destroy you. Oh, I get it. So you went back to the past. I see. That's why you know so much. <laughs> Such a sneaky guy. But I have to say, 
I'm surprised to hear you say you can destroy me. Drunks, I have plenty of data on you thanks to my spy robots. <laughs> you idiots! You don't have enough power to lay a finger on Androids 17 and 18, let alone me! Pathetic! Oh? Then why aren't 17 and 18 around anymore? What? Impossible! So you're the reason the two of them are gone! It's because of you! We're not fighting here in West City. People have worked too hard to rebuild. I'm taking this fight somewhere else. Okay, so try and change the future. Super attack is now available. Okay, so try to change the future. So, uh, awesome. I'm going to defeat you and put an end to all of this. Okay, so the final show that we have to wait. I mean, we need to to like rest for a little while. So, just to go over with Shark. So, uh, we go to party. So, this is the uh, final showdown to the fight cell. I would, I do all along because this uh, happens in the, in the past uh, where, in the, in the future, I mean, where Trance have avenged his, uh, his own, own, own identity to, um, to, to make uh, Gohan proud. To see Trance have grown into a fine man to become a Super Saiyan. So, it seems like we can, like, Dealt to to level up Trunks a little bit more, so it seems like we can go and level that up to the level two. And to me, because uh, we got here at the multi master, which we can go and have that level up to level three. So we're gonna keep leveling up everything, so because the um, the final showdown is it's about to happen. So we got self medication, slowly recover HP, and when surgeon acted. You know what? We can uh, get one of those if you like. And we need to keep getting more of the Z orbs. So we need all the Z orbs we can experience. So that's about it. So we don't have to go and do any more upgrading right now because some of it are just uh, getting less expensive and we want to, to fully train up Trunks a little bit more. So let's just go ahead and move out. So we're going to press B. And we're going to have to define something to the land. He hasn't transformed yet. Okay, so that we have to do you guys some next time on Jack about the Kakarot. We're gonna go ahead and chase that right at the cell later right now because of the final showdown with cell is gonna be coming up on next series so you don't go anywhere and you will be participant on stay tuned on the next series. So next time we'll go ahead and finish the story of uh, Trunks on the, the, the last of its uh, DLC. So if you're enjoying the series so far and you want to see more uh, Jack about the Kakarot be sure to leave an advertiser like, share the video, and subscribe. And if you do subscribe to the channel already, please do hit that notification bell so that you'll be stay up there notified for my news and awesome videos up in the way. So just making sure you guys are staying tuned in and by all means, all each one of the description are filled down below. So if you want to help support the series, you can do so. Review them step by step. Just to help get you started on support my channel and for the series. So that's going to be all it for Dragon Ball Z Kakwa. We'll be picking up more on the next one. So take care guys. I hope to talk to you on the next video.